Hey everybody, Jeremy Senpai here. Thank you so very much for clicking on my video. I do so hope that you like what you have to hear. If you like what you hear, then please feel free to hit like, subscribe, and all that good stuff. Also, if you have any commission ideas that you want to hear from me, you can always send me a message over on my Instagram completely free. Now, let's get into the audio. And as usual, remember always, keep calm and put your headphones on. Now, let's get on to it. Hey, wait up. So, how was your class? <laughs> yeah, I heard about that huge project. But honestly, I'm more worried about your, uh, job, you know? Well, if you're super busy with this, then how are you going to be able to do your spider gig, you know? You're just going to count on your partner, huh? Well, who's your partner? Really? Jeremy is your partner? Ugh, come on. Mr. Popular, Mr. High and Mighty, the guy who basically dumps all his homework on you? Seriously, what exact? What do you even see in him anyway? I know that he's like your number one fan, but at the same time he treats you like garbage. Then again, he doesn't know that you are the same person, but... And speak of the devil. <sighs> Alright, listen up, loser. I don't like you, and you don't like me. Don't call them a loser. I'm sorry. I was talking to my partner. The one that I'm stuck with on this stupid project, not their lapdog. Yeah, well, you're lucky I have another class. I'm so scared. Alright, listen up, loser. I don't like you, you don't like me. So, what do you say we just get this out of the way? Meet me at the park after school, and we'll see if we can knock out this project in one go. Yeah. Unlike you, I actually have a life outside of school. Like what? Well, I have to go to the Spider Fan Club, of course. I mean, the Spider is such an amazing, wonderful, strong hero. Selfless and caring. They are always there for people who need them. <laughs> Not that you would know. I mean, seriously, you could stand to learn something from them. I always see you run away, like whenever the Goblin or the Rhino or Dr. Octopus shows up. They are always right there, and yet I always see you running away with your tail between your legs. How sad and pathetic can you be? That's right. We'll meet at the park. The sooner we get this project out of the way, the sooner we don't have to deal with each other. Now, don't be late, like you were last time. Seriously, if you weren't the number one student in our, in our whole stupid school, I wouldn't have bothered with you. But my grades need, need the boost, so I don't have a choice either. Now, see ya, and try not to disappoint this time. What a jackass. I mean, seriously, I don't even know why you have a crush on him. Yeah, he's super handsome, he's the number one popular guy in our school, but he is a total piece of... Oh, you see a softer side to him, huh? Yeah, I'm sure that's gonna set everything right. Anyway, I'll be there if you need me. I still need to soup up some of your, uh, spider gear. Yep, I'll meet you at HQ when you're done. After all, we do have one or, thing, one or two things that we need to test out. It's about time you showed up. Seriously, I've been here for like 10 minutes already. What, did your watch stop? or something, or another one of those stupid excuses that you always give the teacher? No, I don't want to hear it. Okay, now, what was... Now, what was the theme of the project that you wanted again? 
Hmm. Well, Mr. Johnson, he assigned us these set projects. So what was the one that you said that you were interested in? I mean, you know me, right? Uh, as usual, you're going to do all the work and I'm going to hand it in. Hey, after all, why ruin your project? I mean, why ruin your work when you know that I'm not nearly as smart as you, right? Hmm? What is it? <sighs> Come on. You need the what? <sighs> Seriously, your, your aunt needs you for something? I swear, you're like the worst project ever. You're the worst project partner ever. You just got here and you're already running away. Can't believe my luck. Okay, let's see how much of this I can get through on my own. Oh, crap. The goblin? <laughs> well, well, well. Can the spider come out and play? <sighs> And here I was hoping that they would come over here. But I'm sure if I start having some fun, they are bound to pop out and stop me, as they are so pre-programmed to do so. And wouldn't you know it, I found my first playmate. I'm sure that if I were to say, drop you from a huge building, then, <laughs> then I'm sure that the spider would come running. They, they're, they're not afraid of you, goblin, so n neither am I. Brave final words. What in the, ah! It's, it's you. Well, that's not going to put him down for long. Oh, sure, uh, get me out of here, if, if you be, if you don't mind. This is so amazing, swinging through the city. I never get tired of this. And they're, they're holding me so close. Oh god, I can feel my heart being on my chest. Mm. Thanks, spider. You know, you really seem to have a knack for pulling me out of danger. Honestly, like every week, uh, one of your bad guys seems to take me hostage or something, and yet you're always there to save me. Thank you again. You, you're really incredible. You know, you are a hero to so many people. Alright, now think you can take care of that maniac? Wait, wait! Um... My fr- my classmate. They- they're still in the park somewhere. I mean, I think that they ran away, but, um, can you please check and let me know that they're okay? Well, you see, we're partnered for this, uh, project in class, and I just want to make sure that they're okay, you know? I mean, I give them a hard time, but it doesn't mean that I hate them. I just- I just want to make sure that they're okay, you know? I mean, they're, they're my partner, right? We're supposed to work together and all that stuff. You made sure that they got out okay. Thank you, Spider. I swear, you, you really are a hero. Anyway, good luck taking care of that madman. And don't worry, I'll, I'll get away myself. I know the drill. Ugh, where are they? I know that they said that they had to help their aunt, but the goblin showed up almost right away. I know that they got caught up in all that, and the park is so huge, there's no way that they got out in time. There you are! <sighs> Let me check you, are you alright? I swear, what is with all the dirt on your clothes? What, did you trip and fall while you were running? And you have a bruise. What, did the goblin get his hands on you or something? What? No, I'm not worried. It's just, if anything happened to you, then I get stuck doing the project all by myself. 
And you know me, I've, I've got a million things to do. So, hmm, look, I'm glad that you're all right, so we can do our project together. I'm sure that the spider saved you. I mean, they told me themselves that they saved you and that you got out okay. So, you're all right. But I swear, you're such, you're such a klutz. You really worry me. I'm amazed that you can actually cross the street by yourself. Give me your hand. I said give me your damn hand. Why? Because we're going to your house is why. Well, you said that your aunt need your help, right? And I'm assuming that you weren't able to get home because the goblin showed up. So I'm going to your house so we can do our project and you can help your aunt out with whatever. Yeah, yeah, don't thank me. I'm doing this mainly for my good grade. I swear, you're so pathetic sometimes. But, I swear, that spider hero, you really could stand to learn a lot from them. They know what it means to be a true hero. Hmm. I'm sure it's only a matter of time before we meet each other again. After all, I get in trouble at least once a week thanks to our bad guys. I don't mind it that much, because it means I get to see them over and over. They get to save me, and I get to have a quick glimpse of them. <laughs> well, yeah, of course I do. Everybody loves them. You mean that idiot who runs the newspaper? Please, I will defend the spider to my last breath. They're always looking out for us. And you too. I mean, I hope that you thanked them for saving your sorry butt. That's good to hear. Now, take me to your stupid house already so we can finish the project. <sighs> 